Advisors, my name is Helen Youssef and I will be your Prime Minister this year. My greatest advice to you is to get involved in everything. Throughout high school, despite my challenges, I still did my best to get involved in everything I could, which is how I was able to obtain the position of Prime Minister. I love leading by example, and I believe this is the mindset everybody should have coming into a new beginning. My advice to you is to get involved in sports clubs, teams, and just about any extracurricular activities. I hope to see you all soon. Good luck, Lasers! Hi Lasers, my name is Osaki Nawahahu and I want to be your Deputy Prime Minister for this school year. I came from Sedan's Venture Merchant and my piece of advice for you guys is to break out of your comfort zone. Now I give you guys this piece of advice because when I first came to St. Joe's, I had one friend and that was until I broke into my comfort zone and talked to people and made friends. I also give you guys this piece of information because you're going to be first years in high school, you're not really going to know a lot of people, but you're also going to have to be with these new people for the next four years of your life. And I feel like breaking out of your comfort zone is one way to really like make a connection with all these new people. Good luck, Lasers. Hey there, Lasers. My name is Anthony Huang, a grade 12 student and your Student Senate trustee this upcoming year. Now, my advice for you is to put yourself out there and connect with others. By building up these relationships with not only students, but also staff that you might meet along the way, it offers you so many opportunities in the future. And there's way too many for me to give examples of right now. But as you go through and talk to more people, you'll see the effects yourself. So why not start right now with the people around you and have a nice chat with someone you may not have met before. That's all for me, Lasers. Hopefully you enjoy the rest of your orientation and we'll see you around the hallways throughout the school year. Welcome to St. Joe's. Hi Lasers, my name is JD Yomas and I'm one of your Laser News liaisons this year. I'm going into grade 11 and my piece of advice to you is to try to create a schedule that has a healthy balance between work and fun. I'll see you around Lasers. Hey grade nines. As you're starting this new journey into high school, it may be difficult navigating your feelings about your identity. High school can sometimes make you feel like you need to fit into a certain mold. But remember, your uniqueness is your strength. Embrace your passion, quirks, and style without seeking approval from others. And make sure to surround yourself with people who appreciate and support the real you. Doing this and putting your happiness first will make your high school experience so much better. Trust me. Good luck on your first year, Lasers. Hi, Lasers. I'm Lily Gilbert, and I'm Junior Spiritual Liaison on Student Council this year. One thing I highly recommend while going into high school is to have a really good sleep schedule and get eight hours of sleep every night. This will help you athletically and academically. Thanks, Lasers. Hey, guys. My name is Sean Tianpeng, and I will be the Secretary of Student Council next year. And as a senior, I'd say that perfection should not be your ultimate goal because you'll just never get it. And as a senior, it's something I still struggle with. I think it's all about embracing these mistakes because they only help to grow stronger and smarter. You should look forward to embracing progress and not perfection. Thank you and I hope you guys have a great first year. Bye. Hi Lasers, my name is Marley and I'll be one of your ministers of extracurriculars this year. My advice to you is just to treat everyone the way that you wanna be treated. Everyone is going through something, so just be kind. Hi Lasers, my name is Tessa Ferroni and I am one of your Laser News Liaisons on Student Council this year. My advice to you is to get to all of your classes on time. In doing so, you will create a good relationship with your teachers as you will appear reliable and eager to learn. Also, you will create positive, long-lasting habits because getting to class on time will just become part of your routine. Finally, you will ensure you never miss any important parts of your lessons. Good luck, Lasers, and I'll see you in the hallways. Hey, Lasers. My name's Mai Sabetti. I went to St. Anne's French Immersion Catholic Elementary School, and I'll be going into grade 10 this year as one of your Ministers of Internal Affairs. If I could give one piece of advice to incoming grade 9 students, it would be to stay active and participate in your school community. Joining things such as sports, clubs, and volunteering for school events could really help you to network and meet new teachers, as well as make many new friends. It makes for a much easier grade nine year and provides you with opportunities in the future. Good luck grade nines. Hey Lasers, my name is Tamara and I'm going into grade 11 this year as one of your ministers of finance. One of the best pieces of advice that I can give you guys before going into high school is to try to find friends that align with your values. So let's say you value doing well in school. 
don't surround yourself with people that couldn't care less about that because eventually those values and those morals will be reflected onto you. I hope that piece of advice kind of eased up some of the pressure in picking the right friends to be with in high school and we're excited to have all the future lasers this year. Thank you. Lasers, my name is Maya Guyton and I am your senior spiritual liaison on student council this year as well as a grade 11 student and I came from H.J. Lasseline Elementary School. One piece of advice that I give to you is to not linger in hallways and make it a priority to get to your classes on time. Not only will being late cause you trouble, but you are also setting yourself back and missing work, which can be a really big struggle. So always make sure to be on time to your classes so you're not missing out on anything. And have a great school year. Hi everyone, my name is Maya. My position on SAC is Minister of Public Affairs. I'm going into grade 11 this year and my elementary school was HJL Celine. My advice for you here today is to put an effort, not only academically in work or classes, but in really everything that you're gonna do here at this school. So maybe joining certain things or making new friends. Keeping an open mind with your best intentions is really what's gonna give you the best high school experience. Thanks for listening. Hey Lasers, I'm Neva Skarbesic, one of your grade 11 reps for next school year. I just wanted to give a reminder to all students to always explore your fullest potential. By exploring your fullest potential, you can always discover new things about yourself, such as stepping into your comfort zone and discovering new talents, or even embracing challenges or growing to be the best version of yourself. Always remember that the St. Joe School community always wants your unique skills and ideas to make the school a better place. Have a great school year, Lasers! Hi Lasers, I'm Naya, one of the grade 12 reps for this school year. My advice to all of you is to be bold and talk to new people. It's a new environment for all of you, so it may be a bit scary, but it's the perfect opportunity to make some new friends. Hello, I'm Adam Levesque, and I will be going into grade 11 next year. I'm a student representative, and I used to go to St. John Vianney Elementary School. My advice to you grade nines is to never forget your locker combination. You can do this by typing it on your phone, or writing it down on a piece of paper. Another way to remember is to practice it at home in order to not forget during class. Anyway, see you around grade nines. Hi, my name is Gio. I'm a grade 10 representative, and my advice to you is to enjoy your freshman year as much as you can. Hey Lasers, my name is Eva Gerbesic, and I'm one of this year's grade 12 reps. My advice to you is to show your school spirit. This is important because it fosters a sense of belonging and unity among students while also boosting morale and motivating students to exceed academically and in extracurricular activities. When we proudly support our school at pep rallies and games, we create a positive and inclusive atmosphere. You can do so by wearing our school colors and learning our chants. Good luck, Lasers! Hey Lasers, my name is Macy Brieta and this year I'm going to be a Minister of Internal Affairs going into grade 11. My advice to you is don't be afraid to ask questions. I know it can be a little intimidating, especially because you're not familiar with your teachers and your peers, but asking questions is gonna help you understand what you're learning and is also gonna help you succeed. There's also a high chance that other people around you have the same questions, so there's no need to be nervous. How's it going future grade nines? Mark from Student Council here. I got some advice for you. It may seem intimidating and overwhelming, to come into a new school, but trust me, high school is not as intimidating as it seems. We got very well experienced and very, very awesome teachers here at St. Joe's High School. Our teachers will help you with any questions that you have and will help you throughout your journey here at high school. We have a homework club so you can do some of your work at the school. St. Joe's is a very open and friendly environment it's very welcoming, so you'll feel like you belong here. And there's just so much fun stuff to do here at St. Joe's. You could play sports, you could uh, go into clubs, you could go into the jack room. Heck, you could even go to Easy Pie. Overall, future grade nines. Grade nine is not as hard as you think it is. It's pretty easy. Just do your work and follow the rules. Don't skip classes. Just enjoy yourself, calm down. Because after one week, you're going to get so used to this environment and you're going to get into that rhythm and it's going to be awesome. Thanks for listening, future lasers, and have a nice one. 
Hey Lasers, my name is Taylor Guanyo and I will be your Minister of Extracurricular Activities this year at St. Joseph's High School. I'm going into my grade 10 year now and my biggest piece of advice to give to you guys would probably be to please remember to organize your notes and worksheets that you receive throughout the semester so that when it comes to time to studying and preparing for exams, you got nothing to worry about. Hello Lasers, my name is Zach Alfonso and I'll be a grade 10 representative for this year at St. Joseph's High School. Now one piece of advice I'd want to give to you guys is to always stay in attendance and to not skip your classes just so you don't fall behind on certain subjects and so your grades don't drop because of uncompleted assignments. Hey Lasers, my name is Alyssa and I will be one of your Ministers of Public Affairs this year. My advice to you is to build a good relationship with your teachers and amongst your classmates. Going into grade 9 is a new learning experience, so getting to know new people and your teachers helps enhance your motivation to learn while also having fun making your first year of high school more memorable. Hi everybody, my name is Laura Gallen and I will be your best buddies representative for this upcoming school year. My one piece of advice to all of you is to start studying for your exams or any test really, the second you find out what's going to be on them. Believe me, these tests will sneak up on you. Please do not let that happen. Good luck everyone. Hi everyone, my name is Arkin Kibangan and I am going into grade 12 this year and I will be one of your grade 12 representatives. And I come from Ellie Damaras and a piece of advice that I would give the grade nines coming this year would be to avoid procrastination. I think procrastinating is one of the worst things you can do in high school, especially because our workload is a bit more than you did in elementary school. I think that being on top of all your studies and all your work that you're assigned is a perfect idea to stay organized and you wouldn't want to be stressed by all the workload you have. So make sure to do all your work. Hey Lasers, my name is Emily O'Hora and I'm going into grade 10 this year as one of your grade level representatives and I come from Forest Glade Public School. My advice to you is to just be friendly to everyone and keep a smile on your face because for the first day, it's everyone's first day and everyone is nervous.